Today we're going to talk about the Emporium model. In this model, instead of going to lecture at set times, students come to a computer lab where they can watch lectures and work through problems. Usually the lectures and problems are also available online, so students can work on their own outside of class. The Emporium model is usually done with math classes because doing problems until you get them right works for math content. So, instead of going to lecture for Math 101, listening to the instructor live and taking notes, I watch the lectures online, repeat them as often as I want, and then go to the Emporium space and work through problems in the computer. I might be required to come to the Emporium at certain times, or I might be required to be there a certain number of hours every week. When I come to the Emporium, TAs or instructors will be there to help me when I run into problems. I can practice and then ask for help when needed. The online tools for classes like this usually also have built-in helps as well that try and detect when I seem to be struggling. Hours for the Emporium tend to be pretty flexible. If I prefer to work in the morning or late at night, there's someone there to help. Does the Emporium model work? Depends on how it's implemented. At Virginia Tech, the percentage of students completing the course and achieving grades of D- or better improved from an average of 80.5% to an average of 87.25%. At the University of Idaho, they saw significant gains in A and B students and a reduction of F students in an algebra course, but less dramatic results in a pre-calculus course. You can read more about those results and look at the other 11 universities or colleges that use the model in the blog post. Thanks for watching.